Now that we've got the textures all set up and everything, everything's mapping nicely, which we tested by masking some stuff off. Let's just make something cool. So my idea for this is scaly, scaly green kind of guy. This might, this might actually be pretty cool for a scales. These like flooring could actually be good for scales. That's cool. I'm just gonna run through, download some stuff that I think is cool. Flagstone floor, that's cool. It's like that for many things. Moss, let's make him mossy, that'd be cool. Yeah, that one's nice, it's got lots of difference going on. Now back in your local, select some of these. <laughs> that's just pretty sick in itself, really, isn't it? But you can mess with the projection. Scale. That's pretty cool. <laughs> simple, you know, simple is not always the worst thing. It's actually kind of freaking cool like this. This goes to show it's just like so much madness you can create. Why don't, okay, I'm just gonna save this out like this. Cause he's cool. Do it as an example. Let's get that eye first. I think that's pretty awesome and simple is not always the worst thing. Maybe tiling actually. Oh, <laughs> it's sick. But uh, I like some horror movie dude, but it's really cool. You know, I just, can you ask for much more? I don't think you can. Let's delete that. Here's a cool masking technique, mask stack. Up here on the right, mask component normal. This will do it literally directionally. So for like weathering and stuff, like something's been hit by the sand or something like that, it's like this is really, really sick for that. And like you can see, it's, it makes a detailed mask off of off of this. And like yeah, this effect is just really cool. So if we get the positioning right, could be a bit of like a gold underlay. It's just awesome. <laughs> it's just, I'm just stoked. Stoked on how cool these characters can come out. I'm gonna make that a clean 90. Make that a clean zero. So it's just super symmetrical etoile retexture. Um, maybe let's change this color to blue. <laughs> so awesome. Just have a little play. Never do know if you can find something cooler. Um, can play with blend modes down here. The whole madness, really, in that <laughs> green nasty. Just need to think something that doesn't look to totally horror movie. To be fair, um, I think this is awesome, but I've got to think about what I'm actually using this for, and <laughs> is it just going to scare people? And the answer is yes. Yes, it is. Do I care? It's just kind of awesome. Let's just see. Let's see what it looks like. So, probably done enough here, but next stage is just exporting that to your library. Category face. We could export it as a 3D asset and then just lift the texture off of it. That's fine. Okay. So that's all there, 3D asset. So you have to select a category to be able to export. I'm going to call this face category. Export to library. 
And now in bridge, you should have your retextured model. 